Are you interested in checking Frentity themes or you want to build your own? Let's take a quick look in this video. Hey, welcome to the channel. I'm Lax and I'll be talking about web development, careers and tips and more. So let's go straight to the video. So this is one of my favorite Frentity theme. It's open source. So uh, I'll show you a quick demo of this theme as well. So this is this theme uses Tailwind CSS and you know it has reading progress bar and other stuff. So if you are new to Frentity, it's like Frentity is a React framework for WordPress and it is open united. It, it has its own state manager and it comes with uh, you know style components and uh, other out of the box features as well. So it's like you have to enter your enter your source URL, like your REST API URL, and Frentity will take care of it. So let's take a quick look at the folder structure here. So uh, this theme is built by Eugene. Like, uh, I'm not sure if I'm pronouncing his name correctly. Like, he's really a nice developer here. Uh, when you take a look at his theme, you will be amazed. Like, you know, it is full of features and it's, it works pretty much neat. So you can see this is the theme. So these are the components. So he divided the the various features into different folders like dash books, mark navigation, post, and, uh, and styles and other stuff. So I think uh, let's take a quick look at the theme so that that way you will find it more you know exciting. Yeah, this is the theme. This is the live site. So you can see it has a slider and it has a a nice uh, upstream menu, and you can have you can see it's also it's like you know custom taxonomy. This is custom taxonomy and custom post type. So you can see that you know it's built with Frentity, but it, it feels like because of the Tailwind CSS and the you know uh, I guess he poured his heart and soul in this one. Like you can see the customization everywhere. And also the code, when you take a look at the code, it's really clean and you know, easy to understand. So I also guess like from the beginning, uh, he had a you know, he, he had a plan to make this open source because it's like, uh, doesn't seem like he, he wrote just for himself. Every feature, everything is feature rich and it's very really clean. So we can see here, like, tag with these archives or when you take a look at the inner page and that's that's even more neat yeah so this is the tag and you want to click this one yeah so you can even see this it has a fix your button here so sharing icons and then the post meta details like it's about recipe right so it talks about the recipe cuisine and you know, other custom taxonomies yeah I can see the pretty much formatting here in this uh, at first when I checked it and you can also see the reading progress for here yeah mm -hmm. the image just loaded which is uh, lazy loading and it is responsive as well you know so it uses Tailwind, so we don't have to worry about responsiveness. And these are the features that I really like most because this is coming from my guest recipe maker plugin. So if you are uh, planning to uh, use uh, Frentity and you're using some other extra plugins like either the Job Manager or let's say WooCommerce or something else, not just for blog. You can still customize it to the way you want. So you, you have to spend some more time with it. And this theme can be your you know, starter. So on the other side, uh, 
let's take a quick look at other themes and the features as well. So every Frankity theme uh, is also considered as a package. So you have to install it as a package and you have to configure it and you can set up whether the menu or what uh, features that you want to add and, and things like that. So take a look at this code and I hope you will have a, you know, you can, you, you can consider this as a good reference. Like you can uh, start customizing the existing themes or create your own. And I've been building my own theme as well based on this one because I, I feel uh, this is a good entry point for any developers like me, whether you are a seasoned React uh, developer or like me, someone who is just getting started with modern web development, you can you can check it out. Uh, I think I should say you should check it out. It's really nice. And on the other side, like the Frentity Showcase, go to frentity.org and they have a, a community showcase and that has other themes as well. I guess around like a couple of themes are free and like open source with uh, source code available. So you can fork them and customize them. And the good thing is you can also ask your comments uh, or like uh, ask your questions in Frentity community forum. So have a great time on exploring this theme. And let me know about you know which Frentity theme that you like most and or like if you are creating your own and leave a comment below with your links and we'll take a look. Thanks, I'll see you in the next one.